have the Hero GoPro Hero 5 and here we have the GoPro Hero 6 and we are gonna put them to the test and see how much better is the Hero 6 compared to the Hero 5 and is it worth the price because the Hero 6 is uh, uh, quite a bit uh, more expensive than the Hero 5. First test the uh, stabilizing. We film now in 2.7K. On the Hero 5 we have 30 frames per second. On the Hero 6 we have 60 frames per second and with stabilization on. So let's go! Running test first! You just saw the stabilization test and now we uh, will do a uh, slow motion test. The Hero 6 filming with uh, full HD 200, 240 frames per second and we have the Hero 5 on also full HD on 120 frames per second. You can also have the Hero 5 on 240 frames but on lower resolution. So I went with full HD on both and uh, 240 versus 120. Let's see how they compare. Okay, now we have 4K 30, 4K 60. Let's see how they compare. Okay, so this is the 4K test. You see right now, you see the Hero 6. How's the Hero 6? Does it look nice? And let's switch it over to the Hero 5 right now. How is the Hero 5 compared to the Hero 6? Let's do a side by side comparison. Let's just walk here with, uh, with a bit of sunlight behind me so you can also test out and see the dynamic range. GoPro said that the stabilizing was much better in Hero 6 and also you will get 4K and 60 frames and Full HD in 240 frames, which you do not get on the GoPro Hero 5. And uh, they also said that the dynamic range is supposed to be much better. So uh, you just have to take a look on the comparison footage and uh, make up your mind what you thought was the best. And uh, yeah. Comment down below which camera you think uh, was the best both in the stabilization test, slow motion test and uh, the 4K test. Let's uh, play a montage that we made with the Hero 6 and the DJI Phantom 4.
Oh, 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 oh,